Hey guys, welcome to today's video. So I thought that I would switch things up a little bit and have some fun rating the top best selling products from Amazon. Now I uploaded a similar video to this on my TikTok account, so I thought that I would share a lengthier video on YouTube. And I like purchasing things from Amazon. I like purchasing skincare products, sunscreens, especially products that I cannot purchase here in Canada. I can usually find them on Amazon.com. Now, when you're purchasing skincare products in particular from Amazon, you do need to be careful that you're not purchasing counterfeit products. And I know it's very hard to differentiate between what's real and what's counterfeit, and you normally don't know until you receive the product in the mail, you open up your box and you're looking at the product and you're thinking, this doesn't look too legit, this doesn't look right, it doesn't smell right. And that's usually when you know if something's counterfeit. Now, from my experience in the past and from what Amazon has told me directly, when you're purchasing a product, specifically a skincare product, and you're purchasing it from a third party seller, sometimes these products can be counterfeit. And sometimes if you receive a product from a third party and it's not what you want and you decide to return it, returns can be very difficult as well with a third party. So when I look for products on Amazon, I do like to look for products that are sold and fulfilled by Amazon. That way it's more legit and of course, returns can be done a lot easier. So I thought it would be fun to let you know what the top 10 best selling products are and also let you know whether I agree to where they are ranked from one to 10. So let's get right into it. Also, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up as it really helps my channel. And don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any of my upcoming videos. All right, so let's jump right in. I do have my laptop here, which I'm gonna read off of. And as I'm talking about the products, I will insert the image to that product so that you know exactly what I'm talking about. The way that I'm going to structure this video is I'm going to start with number 10 and work my way to the number one best-selling product on Amazon. And I can tell you right now that I do not agree with a lot of these products. Some of these products I feel shouldn't even be a part of the top 10, but of course that is my own opinion and that is the fun of this video. So let's dive right in and start with number 10. Coming in at number 10 is the Banana Boat Ultra Sport Reef Friendly Sunscreen Lotion Broad Spectrum SPF 15. This is a twin pack for $16.99 US dollars. So I am looking at the Amazon.com bestsellers for reference. So I love that you get a twin pack here for $16.99. That is a great deal. But I'm a little concerned that this is only an SPF 15. I'm very concerned and I can't believe that this is ranked within the top 10 best sellers. This tells me that there are a lot of people purchasing SPF 15 sunscreen for the body and you want to be using at least an SPF 30 or higher when it comes to the body as well as the face. If I were to apply an SPF 15 onto my fair skin right now and go outside, within a half an hour I would start to burn. And of course I have fair skin so yes, this is typical when it comes to my skin tone but an SPF 15 is honestly not enough. It's better than nothing and if you're going to use an SPF 15 then reapply every 20 minutes or every half an hour. You want to make sure that you are reapplying your sunscreen every two hours but if you're going to be using a sunscreen at an SPF 15, you don't want to be waiting two hours. You want to be reapplying before that. So it's best just to stick with an SPF 30 or higher. So Banana Boat, I don't mind this brand. I have tried several body sunscreens in the past, but I remember this brand and the formulations to be very greasy and it transferred onto clothing and bathing suits very easily. Now they're saying that this one in particular is lightweight, it's breathable, and it's non-greasy. So if that is true, then great. But again, SPF 15, not enough. I agree with this being 10 within the first top 10. I'm glad that this isn't number one, but I don't even want to see this on top 10. I don't even want to see this within the top 20. I think that this should be like 50, number 50 in my opinion. Coming in at number nine is the Real Miracle 
pimple patches. You're getting 96 of them for $11.55 American, which is a great deal. I actually haven't heard of this brand before, but these are very similar to other hydrocolloid patches that you see on the market. I have the ones from Coserx, those are amazing. These are very similar. So they're saying that this is great for oily combination, sensitive, dry, normal skin. These are unscented, they're hypoallergenic as well. They are also latex free, non-drying, vegan and cruelty free, and also drug free. So this is a great option. I agree with this being within the top 10 because if you're somebody that likes to pick and pop your blemishes, then resorting to hydrocolloid patches is a great investment because if your blemish is starting to form or you do have a white head and you don't really wanna pick it because of course if you do that, you could experience acne scarring afterwards and post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. So if you have a white head, pop one of those hydrocolloid patches on your blemish, leave it on overnight, or of course you can leave it on for several hours. And when you peel it off, the hydrocolloid patch actually draws out the impurities. It draws out the pus from that blemish and you will actually see it on the patch. It's incredible and I highly recommend. Again, like I said, I have the ones from Coserx and they work amazing. It really helps to reduce the swelling and heal the blemish a lot quicker. So I agree with this. Again, I haven't heard of this brand before, but I'm sure that it's pretty good. It has a lot of reviews. It has over 22,000 ratings and it looks like it's rated a four and a half star. So I agree with this. Coming in at number eight is the Differin Gel, which is Adapalene 0.1%. Now, this product I agree with. I am happy to see this within the top 10 bestsellers, but I'm actually shook that this isn't rated the number one bestseller. I would like to see this as the number one. But this is a great product for people who have acne, a lot of cystic acne. This is an amazing product to clear up your skin and to prevent acne from forming in the future. And this is something that you can use in the evening. Now, I thought about picking up this product because Canadians can actually purchase this on iHerb.ca. If you are a Canadian, we can't purchase this over the counter at our local drugstore. But of course, if you are an American or you live in other countries where you can purchase this over the counter, then that is great. But of course, here in Canada, it's a prescription. So we do have to get it prescribed. But if you've been wanting to get your hands on the different gel and you're a Canadian, head on over to iHerb. I actually thought about picking it up, but I haven't yet because I'm not sure how much usage I'm going to get from it because I am using tretinoin five to six days a week and of course you don't want to be using your differin gel with your tretinoin or with your retinol because this pairing can be very harsh and irritating on the skin. Now with the differin gel this is more for people who have acne whereas tretinoin is more for anti-aging, hyperpigmentation and of course tretinoin can also help with acne as well but differin is the number one product for treating acne according to dermatologists and you do see this product all over TikTok and of course YouTube. So I do like how this is within the top 10 and I think that this is a great product to look into if you have acne. Coming in at number seven is the CeraVe Hydrating Facial Cleanser and you know I love this product. If you've been following me for quite some time, you all know that I like to use this in the evening, sometimes in the morning, and this is just a cleanser that is so moisturizing, it's gentle, it has hyaluronic acid in it as well as ceramides, and it's a great drugstore option. And I think that where it's situated in this list as number seven is a great spot for this cleanser. Of course, you can find so many other cleansers on the market from other brands that could perform just the same, if not better, so I like how this is number seven. I think that makes sense. And this is the value size and it's retailed at $13.33 American. So love this, highly recommend. Coming in at number six is another sunscreen and I want to cringe. This is by Sunbum and this is the original SPF 15 
sunscreen spray. It's vegan and reef friendly, which of course we love. And it's moisturizing with vitamin E. This has over a thousand ratings. It's rated a five star and it retails at $15.99 American. Now I think Sunbum is a great brand and I think that they do have a lot of great products. But with this being an SPF 15 with a spray, no bueno in my opinion. Spray sunscreens are very difficult to apply to the skin to get an even application. And of course, using a spray sunscreen is better than not using a sunscreen at all. But think about being outside on a windy day and you're spraying your body with that sunscreen. All of that sunscreen is being blown away in the wind. A lot of it isn't being applied to the skin and if you're not rubbing that sunscreen into your skin afterwards to spread it around, it's very difficult to get an even application. So I do prefer lotions and creams when it comes to sunscreen, but of course if you are going to use a spray sunscreen, use one that is an SPF 30 or higher. So rated number six, I do not agree with. This needs to be completely removed and this needs to be beside the banana boat at number 51 in my opinion. Coming in at number five is the soft soap moisturizing liquid hand soap that is soothing with aloe vera. This is dermatology tested, paraben free. It is a rich lathering soap for mild and gentle cleansing that washes away dirt and bacteria. Now I have used this exact product many times in my day and I used to work at Shoppers Drug Mart back in the day and I remember this soap being the number one choice in the washroom. I don't know why that is, but anytime I had to go and wash my hands, I cringed because I hated the smell of this hand soap. It was really bad, in my opinion, and when you wash your hands, that smell would be on your hands for hours, and I remember going home after my shift and just washing my hands two, three times with a different soap just to get that smell off my hands. It actually made me feel a little bit nauseous sometimes. I know I'm being a little extreme, but I really did not like the scent whatsoever. And I also found that that soap was very drying as well. So I did not like it. I actually don't like to see this product in the top 10 best sellers on Amazon. I do believe that there are so many other hand soaps out there that are way better than this one in particular, but you are getting a six pack for $5.33. This is rated a five star and there's also 46,000 ratings as well. So I personally don't recommend it, but if you do like this brand, that is a great deal. Coming in at number four is the Paula's Choice Skin Perfecting 2% BHA Liquid Exfoliant, which is the famous salicylic acid product. You are getting one full size bottle as well as one travel size bottle for $36.50 American, which is a great deal. You are saving a few dollars versus purchasing them separately on Paula's Choice. So this is very effective. I 100% agree with this. I do like to see this as number two on the top 10, but number four is still good. And this is very, very effective, especially if you have blackheads, acne, enlarged pores, and you have texture. I have this product and I really love it. I use it one to two times a week and it really helps to keep my skin smooth. It is pretty hydrating, believe it or not, and it does give an instant glow to your skin as well, which I love. So I do like this, especially if you have acne, blackheads, and large pores, but if you decide not to go this route, then I would definitely recommend going with the different gel. Coming in at number three is another sunscreen bundle, and this one I 100% approve. This is by Ulta MD, and you're getting a bundle where you get the UV Clear Broad Spectrum SPF 46, which is a face sunscreen, and you're also getting the UV Sport Broad Spectrum SPF 50, which is a full body 
sunscreen. I personally have not tried the UV Sport before, but I have heard great things about it. And it's great for all skin types and it's water resistant up to 80 minutes. I absolutely love Elta MD. I think that they create a lot of lovely sunscreens and I personally love the UV Daily. I actually really did like the UV Clear as well, but I did experience a lot of pilling with that sunscreen because of the niacinamide ingredient that is in the formulation. It was just too risky for me to continue on with that sunscreen, but if you have oily combination skin, you're acne prone or you have dark spots, that might be a great sunscreen to go to because niacinamide is great for those skin concerns. So I highly recommend this bundle. This retails at $51. It's rated a five star and there's 425 ratings. Number two is Bio Oil. Now this is a product that I absolutely do not like and I would not recommend it either. I don't believe it works. It really does not work. I have tried this several times in the past on different scars and it didn't improve it in the slightest bit. This product is also very irritating because it contains 11 different types of fragrances plus essential oils. So if you have sensitive skin, you have rosacea, I would completely stay away from this product. And this also contains retinol palmitate. So if you're pregnant, you're breastfeeding, or you're thinking about getting pregnant, I would stay away from this product because it does contain vitamin A. So I hate seeing this as number two. I can't believe that this is within the top 10 best-selling products on Amazon. I think that this should be completely eliminated, but if you are somebody that uses bio oil and you're not sensitive to it and you do see improvements with your scarring and your skin, then continue with it, but I personally do not like it. And the number one best-selling skincare product on Amazon right now are the Mighty Patches. And these are those hydrocolloid patches that you apply to your blemishes to reduce swelling and to heal them a lot quicker. You get 36 of them in a box. I'm not sure how much they are because currently they're unavailable so they must be sold out. They are vegan and cruelty free. They're rated a four and a half star and there's over 54,000 ratings on this product alone. I haven't tried these. Of course, I have the Coaster X ones which are very similar. All of these hydrocolloid patches are very similar in my opinion so I don't think it matters with which one you go with but I have heard a lot about the Mighty Patches. Now, I would recommend the Different Gel or or the Paula's Choice Salicylic Acid Exfoliant instead of these because those are true treatments for acne and they really help to prevent future acne from forming. But the hydrocolloid patches are great to have on hand in case one day you wake up with a blemish and you want to treat it immediately. That's where these really come in handy. So I do recommend this. I think that these are a great option and that is the top 10 best selling skincare products on Amazon. So I found this to be really fun. I can't wait to do this again when the list modifies a little bit. I'm not sure how often it changes, but I'm sure it changes weekly. I'm sure it changes pretty often. So I will do it again once I notice that all 10 products are completely different. And I really hope that you enjoyed today's video and that you found it helpful. And I will have all of these products linked below for you in case you want to go and check them out. So thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And of course, I will see you all in my next video. Take care and I will see you guys then. Bye guys.